stronger than you think. What is Vendettas? It's a narrative co-op experience. We're making a multiplayer. We really want it to be um, from the ground up about a narrative as well. You're going to get to use four playable new characters. They've got their own talent trees, they've got their own darkness weapons, uh, and they have their own personality, which kind of leads into the last thing that is kind of a, a dark co-op comedy is what we're calling it. You and your buddies can jump in, jump out. You're still going to get um, a good story. You're also going to be tearing people apart with your darkness powers. <laughs> How it's different, I guess, in the single player is that each of the characters, um, they each have their own separate darkness abilities and weapons. So you've got, uh, you know, JP Dumont, he's got uh, a witch doctor, doctor staff. It lets him throw guys up into the air from a distance. He's got the power of black hole. So when he's going through the game, when you're going through the game as him, you find out different ways that you can level up your, your black hole. You also figure out different ways to use weapons and use his, uh, his pulling ability. Inugami has an amazing sword called Kusanagi that he can slice guys up with. Shoshana has a gun called Armor of the night, which lets you do you know pretty amazing executions, like shoving the gun down the guy's throat. And then you have uh, Jimmy Wilson, who's got an ax that you can throw and you can kind of set up to trap enemies with. You can also you can also cast darklings. So each of the each of the Vendetta's characters all have their own special abilities that you get to play with depending on who you're being. Blah blah blah. Each of the characters, you know, you can play them all differently and get you know different leveling up of their uh, talents and abilities. And uh, each one, I guess, you're gonna take you know between two or three hours to get through the campaign with. And then on top of that, once you're all done, you open up another mode called Hit List, which unlocks all of the missions that you've played in campaign for you to play as many times as you want. And on top of that, there's another additional, I guess, double the amount of missions that have one-off storylines that you can go and play through as these characters. seeing the way different people's talents are really gonna affect encounters. Um, you know, you're gonna have an encounter, you're, you're going in with your friends, you guys are getting overwhelmed, and then all of a sudden, the character who's playing J.P. Dumont, his black hole power recharges, and he throws out the black hole, and it just wipes out that, that wave that's come at you. Or, you know, Shoshana, she's got gun channeling, which means, you know, at the highest end, she can actually shoot through walls, and she can see through walls. So while you guys are getting ambushed, she's gonna see the ambush before it happens, and she's gonna unload with her powers. Take that! <laughs> In single player, uh, the way the game starts out, you're actually handling mainly mobsters. And it's the same, uh, the same theme in Vendettas. Mobsters are your initial starting enemy. And as you progress through the game, in comes the Brotherhood. And the Brotherhood are a totally different class of enemy because they bring that kind of tactical smarts to the fight. Relics are something that are across uh, both modes. So you have relics in the single player game and you have relics in, uh, in Vendettas as well. And those are things that are gonna be hidden in different parts of the, of the environment. You have to find them. When you do, you get uh, major essence rewards and it's also a collection element as well. So there's a really tight integration between the storyline that you're playing in the single player campaign and the narrative events that you see in the Vendettas campaign. They say, if you want to judge a man's worth, just take a look at his enemies. Jackie has, you know, unleashed the darkness. And then the storyline is that he's actually had the darkness contained for the past uh, two years. And so he's let it out. And so he sends these new guys, which are the Vendetta's characters, off to, uh, that's their very first mission, is to go and find Johnny Powell and bring him back to Jackie. How does the difficulty scale? Um, there's a couple different ways. One is that, you know, there's a difficulty select. So if you and your friends are breezing through it, great. You know, narc, take the difficulty and ramp it up to dawn. If you're just adding more players, we do a few things under the hood to make it a little more challenging. The enemies kind of, you know, are a little more aggressive. Um, so, you know, every time you're playing the game, depending if you're playing with more players or you're adding difficulty, you can have a different experience. So the Darkness 2 is coming out uh, February 7th uh, for Xbox 360, PS3, and for the PC.